So the last one is the that we are going to I know to do the and we're going to listen to the fetal heart tone of the fetus. So ma'am, ang gagawin po natin na last one is to listen or pakinggan po natin yung fetal heart tone ng iyong baby. Because it will tell us if it is, if your fetus, if the fetus is healthy or it do have an underlying conditions. So we're going to place the bell part of the stethoscope at the side of the abdomen where the fetal back is located. So, assuming that the fetal back of the baby is located in this. But before that, we are going to warm the, uh, the bell. First, by placing it between her hands. So, accurate measurement equates to accurate finding. So, we must count the number of fetal heart rate in a one full minute. So, mommy, please ko lang po ha. Assuming that this is where the back of the baby is located. So we're going to count it for one full minute. So assuming that it is already done, so we're going to record the data. And then after recording the data, we're going to do the aftercare. So we're going to remove the drape and then assist the mother in sitting position. So remove the drape and then Mama, you see na po natin. Well, tapos na. Thank you so much po, ma'am, sa cooperation nyo. And then, assist the patient in sitting position. So, ma'am, pwede na kayong umupo. So, assuming the mother has already, ano, in a sitting position, and then, inform mother of the results. So, so here are the results, ma'am. The baby is healthy, ma'am. So, always, ano lang yun, ma'am? Uh, always eat healthy foods and, um, a regular a check up and then always follow the physician's um, advices ma'am to have a healthy fetus ma'am and the next we are after that we have already provided health teachings and then we are going to record all the results and observations for the continuity of care so that's all that is the end of the antipartal um, assessment Thank you.